Hey, 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 Facebook friends and family. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody is doing well and blessed and in good spirits. I just want to come on and do a quick video about the four quarters of life. I am in the 30 for 30 royalty challenge where we are going to help 30 families in 30 days and not 30 people, 30 families in 30 days. So I want to talk about the four quarters of life and I want you to think of the four quarters of life just like you would a sports, just like you would a football has four quarters, basketball has four quarters, but the financial game is also the same. Uh, it's a little different, but it's still uh, kind of the same. Most people don't have a quarter to show for the work that they've done. On an average, most people will make about $25,000 per year. If you do the math, $25,000 a year over 40 years is just the average uh, working years is going to equal a million dollars. So most people earn a million dollars through their working years, but how much will they have to show for it? Most people won't have much at all to show. Uh, not even 10% in most cases. Now, 10% of a million dollars is $100,000, and you're going to need more than that because at, by the um, age of 65, when you're no longer working or past the working age, because it's going to take more to sustain and maintain the lifestyle that you're currently living while working. So you do need to be positioning yourself where you can have more money working for you so you don't have to go uh, get what they call a retirement job. And so we're just going to discuss how much you should have um, depending on what quarter of life that you're currently in. So the first quarter of life here is the age range of 25 to 35 years old. So if you are in this range, uh, in this quarter, the first quarter of life, you should have about $25,000. So I'm going to put 25 there. So you should have $25,000 um, somehow. And do, ask yourself, do you have $25,000 working for you, invested, going to your future, or at least even just saved in an account somewhere? Uh, second quarter of life is the 35 to 45 age range. And you're looking at about $50,000 that you should have put away. Again, working uh, for you in some way. Third quarter, the ages of 45 to 55, we're gonna you should be at $75,000. And the fourth quarter is 55 to 65, and you should have a hundred thousand dollars. Okay. That's what you should have. And an OT, usually in the games, the OT stands for overtime. But in the financial game, uh, OT here is going to stand for out of time. Okay. So that's after, that's 65 plus. We're usually... You're tired. You don't, you know, you don't want to, your ambitions for your future and what you planned on doing, um, hopefully are done at that point. And you just want to relax and rest. You don't have the energy that you had, uh, in the previous quarters, the previous four quarters. So 40, uh, working at years times $25,000, that equals that $1 million. And see here, you should go ahead and ask yourself the question, what quarter are you in? And also, are you ready to win the game before OT? How do you plan on becoming financially free, financially stable after your working years when you're not working in that um, full check is not no longer coming in? So you are are you ready to win the financial game before you're out of time? The upcoming videos that I will be doing will be letting you know what you need to understand where you do stand, what's stopping you from reaching your goals, and how to obtain those goals. So again, this is Clacy, and I am doing the 30-day royalty, 30-day, 30 30-for-30 30 30 royalty 
helping 30 families in 30 day challenge. I had a long day. Hey, <laughs> I'm doing I'm doing my best. I'm doing it. I'm gonna get it done regardless. So um anyhow, so stay tuned for my future videos. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to make comments below. And um if you would go ahead and just put uh what quarter you're in, whether it be the first, second, third, or fourth, you don't need to comment and put whether you have the money, <laughs> excuse me, saved or not. But just put your put your quarter, the quarter that you're in, in the comments, and just get to thinking. And I will be coming um, to you again with future videos that um, are gonna build on this particular one. So everybody have a great evening. Good night.